sometimes people are saying praful how it is possible to learn all the technologies because in interview interviewer are asking question from multiple technologies even in your videos in live session many time you told you should have knowledge of all modern technologies how it is possible that someone can master all the technologies they will have knowledge of routing and switching also firewall also automation also ai also sd wan also sd access data center segment routing so many technologies are there is it possible to learn everything and if it is not possible then how someone can clear the interview how i can change my job because i am struggling in my career i don't like this current job but i am working here since last 2 years 5 years 10 years sir why you are not able to change the job by the way sir interview interview is a barrier right the stop is point who is stopping me to change my job i am not able to clear the interview reason interview asking question from the multiple technologies and i wa don't want to learn all the technologies even it is not possible for me what to do you should have knowledge of all the technologies because companies are using the hybrid setup cloud is there on premises is there multiple networking devices are there right virtual router physical router switches firewall load balancer is it possible to learn everything no you can not learn everything what i am saying that you should be expert in one technology right but that one technology should not be routing and switching only you have to be expert in routing and switching there is no any option right you have to be expert in routing and switching the first thing then only you can learn any other technology but even if you are the expert in routing and switching that is not sufficient that 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 technology is not in demand nowadays then why we all should master routing and switching to learn other technology sir right there is no any another way to learn other technologies like sd and let's say sd wan or automation or data center there is no any other option right you have to be expert in routing switching then only you can understand the sd wan so first you should be expert in routing switching now your base is clear now you are ready to become network engineer now you have to master any one technology after routing and switching any one whether you can go with next generation firewall you can master the next generation firewall that is your core skill right not routing switching is here that is additional now your core skill is next generation firewall you are the master in managing firewalls can i get job no you cannot get job then what next now what about the other technologies you should be familiar comfortable with all other technologies now you have expert in routing switching that will help you to learn the technologies with the help of that you have mastered the next generation firewall you want to become a network security engineer that is very clear and crystal now next thing is you have to understand what is st wan no need to master the technologies but you have to be comfortable i know st wan is decoupling the control plane management plane data plane i know about the controllers i know the basic working how st wan is different from the traditional wan architecture similarly i know what automation tools we are using in the industry i am familiar with the basic dashboard i know about the ai tool how i am using ai to gather the logs to monitor the network i know the nexus devices means i am comfortable with data center also and then you will go for interview and this time when you are comfortable with all the technologies you are expert in one technology and expert in routing and switching no one can stop you sir to clear your interview even just in 2 to 3 years after getting 2 to 3 years experience you will see your life 
has started growing exponentially growth will be like this right so i never say says you need to master all the technologies you have to be master in one technology right any one technology which we are using nowadays right routing switching will not work routing switching is mandatory because routing switching is the foundation right like i want to be a engineer right i should have 10th certificate it is like that to become engineers whatever syllabus is there definitely i have to cover that but first i should have 10th and 12th certificate to get admission in the engineering college similarly to get admission in the networking industry you have to be expert in routing and switching and ccna is the best way to start to master routing and switching even today ccna and ccnp ccna and np means ccna 200301 ccnp in core and ccnp in rc will make you expert in the routing switching at the same time it will make you familiar with many other technologies like automation ai stn right so if you are going to learn ccna and ccnp today ccna and ccnp sometimes people are saying i did ccna ccnp in routing and switching sir and madam boys and girl there is no any ccna ccnp in routing and switching always remember that if you are going to learn the old ccna 10 years before syllabus if you are covering that today i'm not talking about that ccna i don't have knowledge about that by the way i'm talking about today's ccna's updated syllabus if you are going to cover this you will have a strong foundation in routing and switching you will be expert and you will be familiar with all other technologies like st wan you will have some knowledge of firewall as well so you can start working in the company you can find the job if you are the fresher no problem at all if you are already working professional network engineers you can also start with ccna ccnp in 4 to 5 months you can master it after that you can go for job change easily you can crack the interview you can get the job and if i will talk about the job guys so huge amount of jobs are available even more than 50000 jobs are available for network engineers the fresher can also apply i'm not talking about the experienced one only fresher can also apply so so many jobs are there in the market for experienced if you have 2 years of experience 5 years of experience network administrator automation engineer wan architect right so many job roles are there and lots of jobs are there demand is keep increasing in future demand will be keep increasing all our modern technologies are going to work on network right so if you are working with the network if you are network engineer or any engineer in the networking industry that means you are already working in the world most demanding industry growing industry right but there is only one rule you cannot stop learning after ccna ccnp you will be eligible to change the job but after getting some experience again you have to update yourself so let's suppose you have started learning nnp today right so in next 5 month you can master it then again next 5 month you will be getting familiar with all the topics technologies right while moving walking sleeping right sitting reading every time you will be getting some kind of queries right you have to involve it in your life and every day you will be thinking about that talking about that right and this way in one year you will be expert and then you can decide to learn other technologies you can choose st wan you can choose firewall you can choose cloud you can choose automation right based on your interest so sir and madam boys and girls demand is very high companies are struggling to find a skillful engineers and networking is never a dying industry you are already working in one of the most growing industry 
so don't worry about anything just focus on one thing that is your learning keep learning every day learn at least one new things if you are not learning the new things maybe you are revising the previous topics right you have completed ccna ccnp you are revising some of the topics from that is also learning so if you are updating your skill in the networking industry no one can stop you to move further you can achieve anything in your life and if you are the dreamer if you have goal if you have some objective vision want to achieve something in your life i will recommend you to learn every day even you can skip your working for a day but don't skip a single day for learning right you can learn everything from your mobile phone sir even the live classes you can join from anywhere through simple mobile phone laptop while traveling you have access of inter internet right you can sometime let's suppose today i have learned os pair warning protocol and i am traveling somewhere i'm just sitting in the train or buses i'm traveling the bus so i can check some questions related to os pair i can try to solve right this way you can improve your skill and if you are learning in the networking industry so demand is very high i had started my career in the networking industry just around 10 years ago and today i have achieved lots of things guys even i am earning more than crores per annum right i have never thought that one day i can achieve this this, this all but i have achieved this all just because of my learning i am keep learning every day i am updating myself at the same time i am teaching you can also teach start teaching to your juniors if you find someone is struggling to learn ccn and ccnp and you are the expert in that it's your responsibility to teach them and when you will start sharing your knowledge not only while teaching even when someone is asking questions on social media you can share your answer in the comment if you will do that your skill can go to next level and this will help you to grow your life professional life this is parful mishra signing out until we meet again thank you